Um, hi, my name is Caitlin Fuller, and this is my video to response to whether the media has the right to out someone. And to that, I have to say no. Um, this is a deeply personal issue for a lot of people. Some people might be at different points in their lives where they're not ready to share this information. This is also something that's incredibly, incredibly intimate detail of someone's life that uh, they just might not want to share with the public. And I don't think that is the media's place to say or to tell the public at all. I don't think this had anything to do with their ability to perform well in the Olympics. I don't think it had anything to do with their ethical choices. Um, being gay is not a choice. Um, so was it too far? Uh, yes. Uh, like I said, this is very intimate detail. And that it, you know, it, it, it affects their lives in ways that it shouldn't. You know, they're, they're playing a sport. Um, their sexual orientation has nothing to do with that. And it's not news to me. Um, so to touch on that, you know, the next question is, what should the media be talking about? And they have the right to talk to Olympians and report on the Olympics, absolutely. But this is not anything to do with the Olympics. This is something to do with their personal lives, something that has it's it's so private and I don't understand why this would ever be okay um, or even considered ethical I don't know what was going through the Daily Mail's mind when they wrote this or they assigned it um, I have to agree that it was nothing more than a plot to get clicks um, you know as an ethical journalist that's something I think we should try to avoid that as best we can especially in this world of um, fake news uh, we should really strive to not be fake and that we should really strive to per report on things that matter and things that are ethical and this in that, that instance is absolutely not ethical you know this seriously damaged people's lives and altered their lives in ways that they did not ask for and they did not deserve they have done nothing wrong they're not bad people they're just gay and I don't think it was that reporter's place to pry into their lives and announce it to the world when they didn't do anything to deserve treatment like that. Um, does this story change how I feel? I would say no. I think I have always felt this way about uh, journalists and going too far for a headline. I know it's very, you know, it's very um, tempting, it's the word, to do it because you will get clicks, but it's not ethical. And so with all that said, my answer has to be, uh, this is completely not okay. I consider this to be extremely unethical and extremely unacceptable. And as far as the response, well, we'll see.